A testimony in a federal courtroom is giving a jury an inside look of the relationship of a man and his wife. The same man who was accused with his brother of plotting to kill and killing his wife in Coffee County. WDHN's Aaron Dixon joins us from outside the federal courthouse in Montgomery with the latest. And Michael, a longtime friend of Jason Starr and Sarah Starr, took the stand. And at one point, he said he heard Sarah say, he is going to kill me. Now, Jason and his brother Darren are on trial and are accused of plotting to kill and killing Sarah Starr in November of 2017. The longtime friend said that his wife became best friends with Sarah and would hear bits and pieces about Jason and Sarah's marriage. But it really wasn't clear until he helped Sarah move out of her home to move to the church parsonage off of County Road 647 in Coffee County, the same parsonage that Sarah months later was found dead from two gunshot wounds. They helped her move, a quick move, he says, because allegedly Sarah was afraid Jason would come home. Then when they moved into the parsonage, Jason showed up trying to go up to the stairs to see his wife, but he was stopped by the longtime friend who told Jason not to go inside to see him. He says that during the meeting with Jason, Sarah was observed to be shaking, crying, and quote, completely broken down, end quote. Jason eventually left the parsonage and the, later, and the two later divorced. The family friend says Sarah said multiple times to him that he, he meaning Jason, was going to kill her. Where, where in the divorce agreement, Jason has to pay Sarah 51% of his over $6,000 monthly salary, which prosecutors is, is, say is the driving force for Jason to want to hire his brother through seven payments through a third party to kill his ex-wife. Now, trial has wrapped up to, for the day, but it will pick back up tomorrow morning at 9 a.m., a trial that both sides feel will go into next week. Reporting from downtown Montgomery, I'm Aaron Dixon.